be back. So this is the first, I guess, second day, D-Day 49 of B2B Melody Challenge. And today's question is, B2B들 알게 된 계기, how I came across B2B. Um, I have a video where I talk about this for a very long time. Um, I will leave it down in the section below with a link. You can check on it if you haven't watched it yet. I bet you already watched it. But um, briefly, in summary, um, I'm gonna just try to finish this video in like two minutes. So my cousin, he had a MP3. I know, right? I'm so old. I, it was like I was an MP3 generation. Um, it was like a red MP3, and he gave it to me when he was moving. And it had two songs, "Kozimar" by Big Bang. Oh my gosh! And "Second Confession" by Pete's Beat. Two months ago, big. And I would listen to it, and I was like, "Dang! Like this is really good." Like. This artist is really good. I really like the cute lyrics and it's really cute. But like I was in the States and I didn't have a phone and I didn't have like a laptop. And I was like a more like a nerd girl, like in the bookstore or in library. I didn't know like K-pop much then. Um, so I didn't know like it was a group. I thought it was one person singing the entire thing. Like I thought it was like one guy whose name was B2B singing the entire thing. Thinking back now, it's weird because like all of their voice colors are really different, but I don't know why I thought of that like that, but yeah. Um, I was more of a Taylor Swift, One Direction, Ed Sheeran, Five Seconds of Summer person, you know, like those pop stuff. But yeah, that's how I became to know B2B. So how did you guys no, B2B. How did you meet B2B? How did you come across B2B? Did you hear from your friend? Did you find it on the internet? Probably it's YouTube because they're so famous for their funny videos. But I want to know what you guys think. And let me know in the comment section. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!